Hey guys, what's happening? I'm your host, Jared Bronstein, and welcome back to another video here for you on life's biggest questions. Today, we're going to be taking a look at what would happen if Earth collided with another planet. Before we jump right in, make sure you are subscribed and of course have notifications on so you're the first to know when we post. Also, drop a comment below with a question you've always wanted an answer to. And on that note, Let's get into the video. The idea of another planet colliding with Earth seems like a far-fetched one. But believe it or not, scientists are under the impression that is what happened approximately 4.4 billion years ago and led to us not only having life on Earth, but this collision also spawned the birth of the moon. Although it's a hypothesis, there are a handful of factors that support the evidence. These factors include the moon having a lower density than Earth, Earth and the moon's orbit having similar orientations, among many other factors. However, of course, more research needs to be done to 100% confirm this and the impact it would have had 4.4 billion years ago is nowhere near as severe as it would be today, at least depending who you ask. So let's explore this idea of another planet colliding with Earth. What would happen? How quickly would it happen? Would anyone survive? I will answer all these things over the course of this video, but let's start with what would happen in chronological order. First things first, we know it's coming. With the rate we're advancing technology, astronomers and scientists have been able to learn so much about our solar system and space in general that they would 100% be able to detect if another planet was headed our way. And if for whatever reason their radar wasn't working, we'd be able to see the incoming planet with our naked eye while it's still very, very far away. A good example would be Venus, which is at its closest, approximately 38 million kilometers away from Earth. It's the closest planet to Earth, yet at 38 million kilometers or 24 million miles, it's still pretty far. So if a planet were to collide with Earth, we'd see this planet coming our way even when it'd be millions of miles away from impact. And unless we all have some sort of personal spaceship that we could hop in and join Elon on Mars, we'd be in for some pretty tough times as this planet got closer. But it could be weeks, maybe even months away at this point, slowly just making its way over. As the planet gets closer to Earth, gravity would start to go all out of whack and it would pick up some serious speed. Tsunamis, hurricanes, storms, any natural disaster you could possibly think of would destroy most of the Earth and almost anything on it. And as the days went on, these disasters would get much more intense. But somehow, some way, if you were able to survive the kind of natural disasters you'd only find in a Michael Bay film, well, you'd be far from safe. Eventually, as the planets got closer to each other, Earth's core would start to heat up and burn from the inside out. But the heat from the other incoming planet, of course, would also start to burn Earth's surface. Earth would literally be burning from the inside out and outside in, as with this other planet. By this point, it'd be a matter of hours before the two planets actually meet. When the two planets did finally collide, it would be extremely messy. Pieces of magnum rock would be flying all over the place and the collision would see both planets break into small pieces of rock, ash, or dust just floating around space. But what would happen afterward? Well, aside from the fact that there would be absolutely no sign of intelligent life forms on what used to be Earth, it's possible a new planet with life could spawn. As previously mentioned, that's the common belief with how life started here on Earth. In regards to the other planets in our solar system, well, they wouldn't have the same fate as Earth or this now destroyed planet. If anything, they might have some debris hit their surface, but as the solar system previously did, it's believed everything would just work itself out. Now, of course, our world isn't going to collide with another planet for at least, I don't know, another four billion years. I mean, I'm no scientist, but what I can say is when and if it happens, I won't be alive. So I'm not too concerned, and you shouldn't be either. Unless you're planning on getting yourself cryogenically frozen, then you might have to be concerned. But if you have that much money, you should probably just invest in a spaceship with Elon. Anyways, guys, that does it for this one. If you enjoyed, please do let us know by giving the video a thumbs up. Make sure to drop us a comment below. And as always, be sure you're subscribed to the channel so you guys can have all the answers. Now let's reply to some comments from the video. What if President Donald Trump bought Greenland? And I say it like that because when I said Greenland, a lot of you guys let me know in the comments that I was saying it wrong. So it's Greenland. Is that right? I don't know. Jaden N. Hernandez said, oh my god, I was literally thinking this question days ago. Yo, bro, we're always listening. Always. H2O Gaming said he would build a bridge, make Denmark pay for it. I don't know. I mean, Mexico still hasn't paid for this, for this, for this wall, so I don't know. Delphi Riddle said the 51 states of America just doesn't sound right. Well, believe it or not, a lot of Americans think there are 51 states. Some think there's 52. So maybe it'd help the, the general public in America. I don't know. I'm half American. I thought there was 52 states for like the longest time. But that's when I was younger. There's 50 now, right? Yeah. Anyways, guys, that does it for this video. Once again, I've been your host, Jared Bronstein. Be sure that you are subscribed. Give the video a thumbs up and share it with a friend if you enjoyed it. And of course, drop us some comments down below with questions that you want answers to. And we'll see you guys in the next video.